So what happened to your bike, Jed? Yeah? What happened to your bike? This is a 1945 Pidgeot. She used her and threw her out. So anyway, baby, it's gonna be okay. Tutakutengeneza tena usijali. It's gonna be okay. Hello guys, welcome back to Amoke Vlogs. This is the number one events, travel and adventure YouTube channel. I hope you are doing great as I am also doing okay. So let me first start by wishing you a happy new year. I hope the year is still young and uh, you can uh, accept my new year wishes. So uh, this year it has started well. As Amoke Vlogs, I'm intending to give you guys nice nice after nice after nice content so i have this new series called showcase with amoke vlogs so actually this is our first episode for the year 2023 and uh, i hope you guys will enjoy it showcase with amoke vlogs is just a matter of uh, you guys suggesting what you want to see uh, maybe it's a build maybe it's a garage someone a beautiful home just something you pride of that you want to inspire people with out there uh, so that you can come have a seat and we talk about it so that's why today i am here along uh, the thicker road in ruiru uh, at omar's garage doing our first episode of a uh, showcase with amoke vlogs anyway always remember to leave a like leave a comment share and subscribe to Amoke Vlogs. So guys, uh, Omar just came in with this green gladiator. Think, come. Hey, Karim, bro. Hey, bro. Is that? <laughs> How are you? How you doing? Bro? Happy New Year. Hey, good Happy New Year, Bana. Today Karim, I'm Sanabana. here. Ah, Karim, Bana. I'm, finally. I'm seeing you have a very, very big and nice place here. The garage. Uh, uh, man, you know, at least when, when you believe in yourself and you believe in something which you're uh, doing, you have to invest on the place and uh, on yourself uh, and on the tools. Mm. That means you believe in what you can uh, do. Did you even break for Christmas? Or you were just here? Uh, for Christmas, we break for Christmas Day itself, uh, 24th. Uh, uh, 24th was uh, our closing uh, end of year party. Uh, we had a mbuzi. Uh, uh, a mbuzi hapa hivi. Mbwana kuni invite. Mbwana kuni invite. Mbwana kuni invite. I think he literally slipped to my Indiango, but uh, anyway, the, what I'm planning is uh, now on Fridays uh, or on the weekends, uh, I'll be inviting over my friends to go and spend a lot of time, uh, Pamoja, like uh, my, my, my car enthusiast friends, uh, I'm my best your Karibu, uh, my clients, to now what now this weekend, what you do, if I'm Yama, Kilota, to me. To not find a barbecue, uh, sometimes to not find a cook. Somebody is calling me. Let me check his who. Uh, sorry for that. Ah, uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, Kevin, give me ten minutes. I'll I'll call you back. Okay. So, uh, showcase with Amoke Vlogs, just a, a new series uh, mm -hmm. that will be running under Amoke Vlogs. Okay. You see, Amoke Vlogs is all about events, travel, and adventure. So, you can showcase anything. You, like yes. you, you have builds here. Some yeah. some people have nice rides. Some sure. people have nice houses. Yeah. Just something you pride of. Great. So, today, the first episode, I, I say that, let me come to Omar's guys. Ah, very privileged. Yeah. Yeah. This, this is the first episode. Yeah. In the yeah. First episode of Fungo Omar. I'm very privileged. Thank you so much, yes. brother. In, so, uh, so Omar, to Karibisha Kwe Garage. Yeah. No, no. Eh. Let's start with the office first. Yeah, bro. Uh. Sasa, now, uh, my office, basically, if you can see the background, uh. Uh, mostly is about cars that I love, cars that I admire, cars uh. that I own. Uh. Mostly the things that I have is uh, things that I owned or I own. Like um, the bike there, yeah. that's a Harley Davids. Uh. The Harley Davids, if, you, if you're on Facebook with me, Omar Papa, uh. on my Facebook, uh, you can find me on my Facebook, uh, 
that's a bike uh, that I own in Dubai. Uh. Because I, my garage, you know, as you know, my garage started in Dubai. Oh, in Dubai. Uh, well, I, I entered Dubai 2006, Mwisho, uh. starting 2007. Uh. Alafu ni kakauko for 14 years and mm. uh, when I came back, mm. officially actually when I came back, mm. this early corona ilianza uh, 2021 is it? Ah. 2020 or 2021? 2019 December. Okay, yeah. officially it ikaanza okay. ika no, January, uh, February, uh, end of, end of uh, Feb, mm. Jan, Jan, January, February. Mm. That's when I got stuck in Kenya. I was like, ooh man, I'm stuck. Ah. Yeah, not going back. Sasa, what do I do now? <laughs> Let uh, me. I'm stuck. No, uh, no planes. Nothing. Everything is on lockdown. Uh, so I had my place up. I had a two-acre land just next to uh, Zitek University. Have uh, you seen that? There's a there's a club there and yes. it was a, a square seven or something. Yes. I had a club there and I had a garage and a car wash mm. and I built my place like two acres land mm. from the ground up. I made that place like Sasa, since it was a first of all, it was a club. Uhuru said clubs ifungwe zote na yeah, all COVID. churches and mosques, <laughs> everything ifungwe. Social, uh, social places zilifungwa. No gathering. Uh. So what did I have to do? Now I had some bikes because my club was a, was like the garage club. Uh. You know, you can enter stables, but it was like the garage. Uh. You know, joy, yani kona bikes, ndani. Uh. Ikona some nice toys, ndani, ndani. Uh. Yani like some good, good stuff. Uh. Yeah, my motorbikes. I had a collection of, uh, I think, five, six bikes. Yeah which were bikes I had bought mm. some five, seven years ago. They were like junk, but they had never started. So I started building by my, by my own. Uh. So what they are not allowed to go anywhere. Mm. But you see now me, I was like, okay, since let me start building my bikes. Mm. I started building my bikes, uh, pole pole. I made mm. my bikes into cafe racers. Mm. And by the way, those bikes really came through for me because when I was de- when I was broke, even when I was young, I was from from Nyanyuki, uh, uh, Batuk, Wakakujo, Kazinunua, you know, like the uh, BMW R100, that's a thousand cc. Uh, I converted it and made it into a cafe racer. Uh, I had a 600, a 650 BMW as well, airhead, and I was uh, CX500, one of the most wanted bikes in mm. the world as a Cafe Resa project. Those mm. are the top three bikes uh. in the world which are really wanted. And uh. then I had a Pijot. I have, I still have that Pijot uh. 1942. Uh. Uh, that one is a moped. When I ride, when I ride, you start feeling. Oh, it's a Yes, yes. <laughs> it's a lazy motor. It's kind of dirty. Uh, well, it's okay. Yeah. We just want to see. It. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So. Um, then I started building my things. Then uh, my garage was ongoing. Uh. So nika invited a cousin Chrome while he We came for, we had an event at uh. cousin Chrome uh, while he could garage yangu mm. with uh, so many cars and so mm. many minis and all this thing. We had a ball. Big. <laughs> yes. Uh. And, and you know, those guys are my friends. Uh. So um, from there, I opened a bike garage. I have the full custom garage for bikes. Uh. Harley David's my bike, uh. Nini. But my management at that time was like, uh, you know, we we're trying to manage within mm. COVID. Mm. So it was very, very really hard. Yeah. Yeah. So now, uh, when I saw that uh, I'm actually paying a lot of rent, mm. and uh, I, I can't uh, continue for seven months to Lifungwa, mm. we are open for, for one month with regulations that you have to close. Mm. I now open within an hour. No, sorry, from five to seven. Mm. I, I, I won't manage. Then again, took a funguliwa for a month. Then again, restrictions. I said, ah, you know what? Let me just call it a day. Mm. Nika fungua. Nika, I left that place. I came to open here. Oh, so when did you open this place? Which year? Now this place. Huh. This place. Um, this is my second year oh, on this location. Year. Yeah, oh. just Apple will come. Yeah, Zitek at Konyuma. Zitek. Yeah. Well, I say this place now, it's picked up. Mm. People have known the place, the location. It's really good. It's mm. on the super highway. Mm. Uh, it's convenient for mm. anyone to visit. We are in the thicker of the biggest highway in, the, in yeah. East Africa. Yeah. So uh, I think uh, if you really focus on, on your problems now, SMS, nothing is impossible. You know, when, mm. when, when things hit you, mm. Mungu, Mungu alikwanani prepare for, for, for a better day. Yeah. I'd say that I'm doing better here than there. Mm. <laughs> I don't know how to explain that, but 
you know, like uh, in, in, in terms of the garage, uh -huh. but the club was being really good. Uh -huh. Well, the club, so to say, me, so to speak, that uh, club Ilifungwa. Mm. Now we are going to, we are coming up with another uh, joint in uh, Juja. Mm. Yeah, Kujuja Kwa container right next to the university. Mm. So uh, I'll invite you guys when it's open officially, maybe in the next three weeks. And three weeks. Yeah, so uh, what I want to say is uh, perseverance, mm. nikitumuimu. Mm. Trusting in God, mm. Mm. believing in yourself is kitu mm. Having the people who love you around you and supporting you is mm. very, very important. Mm. But I tell you one thing, the moment you sit down and say you've given up, mm. that's the end of you. Ah, true, true. You imagine, I just lost a 28 million project. Mm. Pale. What, what would another person have done? And kwa ameenda, ameenza kuingia or depression, drugs, depression. Before you knew it, I would be six feet under. True. But I didn't let that hold me. Mm. Immediately when I, when I, when I, when I, when this happened, I mm. jumped to this. And I, I was like so stressed mm. that see good times how work. Can you focus on the stress? On so the I wanted stress. to put that focus and, mm. and channel that stress mm. on that, those, mm. those machines I was building. Yeah. So, Nikatengeneza is a bikes. They were very, very beautiful. Those ones I did with my own hands. Do you want to help and help us? I don't know if you believe in me, I did how you quite successful. Yes, <laughs> yes. So, I built those bikes. They gave me a lot of business. I sold them for a lot of money. Um, I opened up this place. When I opened up this place, everyone thought, ah, this guy, because you know what happened is I had bought some cars in Dubai. Uh -huh. And people said, ah, he need junk. Is he? What is that? Oh, so what is this you, guy you, thinking you bought about? the cars in Dubai and shipped them to Kenya? No, I bought the cars in Kenya while I was in Dubai. Oh. No, no. Uh -huh. I have some cars which I bought from Fleet, Fleet here, Queen Elizabeth. Mm. Those cars, originally, they were, they were owned by... Queen Elizabeth, mm. while of Tukiruli wa Kenya. Uh. Kuna gari zingene za 1919, that's a uh, Ford. And you still have them today? Ford Popular, yes. Oh. I have them, they're right here oh. in my garage. You'll go see them. Yes, I have another car which is um, Chevrolet, uh. 1942. Uh. That's called the Style Master American. Uh. It starts by the, it looks like a junk, and, but it starts. Uh, it's stock. It's stock. Oh. It's stock. Then I have um, I have another Ford Prefect, mm. which is a 1938. Mm. Na nimei, nimei custom, long chest. Mm. It's going to be a limo. For hire parties? Yes, for, for events, for parties, yeah. for mass garage people yeah. to kenda sherehe. So it's a limo and old school? Yes. <laughs> Something out of this world. Yeah, because yeah. it's right if you find a old, old school that's limo. Yes, because mm. people buy the new Mercedes wanafanya. Limo, or, stretch, yeah. or the Lincoln or the stretch, yeah. yeah. So I'd say that uh, if you let your stress, you know, that it, it went yeah. behind my back, yeah. my mind, as in uh, I, didn't, I didn't stress anymore yeah. because at the end of the day, Mungu alifanya mm. ile skill nilikuwa niko nayo, now it's the one which is actually paying mm. the bills. Uh, COVID came as a blessing to some people. Yes. It came as a curse to some, but yes. some it came as a blessing. Yes. So Omar, yeah. before we move out to see these bills you are talking about, let's mm -hmm. still come back to this uh, office of yours. You yeah. say that uh, uh, the things we are seeing here, some mm -hmm. you owned and uh, others you still own. Yes. So that clock, <laughs> I'm seeing a plane. <laughs> Do you mean that you have owned a plane? <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing that beautiful clock there. I knew you were going to start with that. <laughs> Um, that plane is inspired by my love for planes, bro. Ah. Because uh, I'm a real certified pilot. Uh, oh, yeah, uh, pilot. Yes, I'm a certified pilot, ah. uh, PPL. Oh. Yeah, so I've got a PPL license. Mm. I fly. Mm. If you're on my Facebook, then you can see me sometimes they're going to mm. goof around uh, uh, at Wilson. Mm. No, no. So um, I, I, I love planes. Oh. I love anything with you know when i used to be a kid i used to look at those uh. how can something so heavy fly fly walk jaribu kuruka the g forces will bring you down yeah no no but mm. something so heavy it's you know so i was fascinated uh. i wanted to know more that's why you see me when i'm going to the shows when i first met you at, at this year's concluded i was wondering yes. why is this guy dressed in a, a pilot 
Yeah. So t- when you are with uh, Tumbili. Uh, Tumbili. Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. wondering why is this guy dressed in yes. this suit? So tell us more. I'm seeing. Yeah, so that is my love for the planes. Uh. This is my love for Volkswagen yeah. Beetle. Yeah. I love Beetles. I have never owned one, yeah. but I love them. So I collected one. It's always been my wish to collect one. I wanted to have uh, mm. an oval window, mm. Volkswagen Beetle, but I, I never, I, I got them, but they were being sold like crazy, yeah. crazy prices. Yeah. So yeah. I, I wasn't I wasn't able to get one. Mm. I believe right. in the future. Now, when, when you keep on saying this, that's that's you calling mm. to your God, Kumambia Utapata. Yeah. Uh, this, is uh, Camaro, mm. uh, 1969 Camaro. And they just, they look real. It's a cabisa, bro. Uh. As you can see, the engine, nice. the engine is like killer kit. You got nitros, got mm. twin turbos. Check out this you know? engine. Huh? You got a speaker. And heavy. Yes, it's the real deal. Mm. Check out that. Now, as you may notice. Mm. The car behind you there, that's that car. That's why I built oh. it on that theme. No, no. So I have a car right behind you, mm. Pale. Yeah. If you notice, you go up. We need to, uh, this one, I call it the Fast and Furious. Uh, this one is a Lamborghini, Lamborghini. Aventador. Mm. I love it. Uh, I love Lamborghini. I'm always uh, admiring Chris Brown. I can do Aventador Zake. That's nice. got the Lambo doors. This, uh, I love Lambo door. I have a Mercedes SLK convertible, two door, uh, with the Lambo doors. Oh. I also have the latest nice. Camaro ZL1, the one which was used at the Transformers, uh, Transformers movie. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nice. Uh, right behind you, Palek, on a Mini. I own one of them. I used to own one of the most the yellow beautiful, one. the yellow, orange one. Oh, orange one. That one got sold. It's, it's been driven by Supercar Blondie right now. Oh, ah? Uh? British lady bought it. From Kenya, flew it out. She bought it uh. in Kenya at the Concas. Uh, we have the Lamborghini Adventado with the Lambo dolls. Really amazing. And uh, when uh, Chris Brown came to Kenya, when he did his uh, preview and uh, his show for 90 minutes, he owned the money to buy this beautiful machine. So this is a Lamborghini Adventado. Very amazing. Even Chris Brown Monyana need a Jipange. Na show moja ya kali sana ya Kenya and yonu wegari kamai. So this, he made 100 million Kenya shillings for 90 minutes. And he bought this car. Immediately when he went back, he bought. He has a kona Adventado, you kona Lamborghini, na, 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 na this um, Galada. You kona Galada na kanunu Adventado. This is a beautiful car. So, uh, do you mind guessing which car this is? This is a Porsche. No, no, I'm Porsche. Oh, Porsche. It's a Porsche. Yeah. So it's a Porsche. That is. A, it's coming with a rear engine. Um. Uh, it's really something amazing. Now I own this car in Dubai. I own it. I own it. I own it. So, Engineer came a attack from Guka. So, oh, oh, okay, Nemakucha Sina. Yeah. So that's that's the rear engine, eh? Twin cam. Yeah. So it's really, really amazing. Uh, very beautiful car. I met to make in so many movies. It's really a car that people enjoy and love. Uh, it was used also for racing. It's called a Porsche 356. It was a collab between uh, Porsche and yeah. VW. So they built this project, Pamoja. Night one races, it got some Achilles on it. So uh, it's an amazing car. And then uh, this is the one Chris Brown had before. Na Pia Echo na Lipiga now. Lamborghini Calado. So that's the Calado. Yeah, yeah. So very beautiful machine. Just coming to Kenya, doing yeah. 90 minutes performance. And all that performance. Yes. So Alikwa, I mean, no, I old school. Akapata ile new school. No, no. Even Chris Brown has to grow from one car to the next. Yeah, yeah. see kama Cristiano Ronaldo na nani wanaenda kununua tano tano at the same time. <laughs> yeah. This is a Mina, Mini. Uh, this is a Cooper. Uh, I love Minis, as you know. You saw yeah. my other Mini in the, in the car show, Concas de Elegance, yeah. where we are nice. competing. In a Ford. That's a Ford, one of the first Fords to be built. Yes, 1926, Kina Henry Ford, this is one of the first Fords to be built. This one had steam engine or something? 
Well, uh, the steam, yes, yes, yes. It had steam in general. No, I can't hear it. I steam. I can't hear clear steam. Hmm. Built, kabisa, bro. Uh, that's that's uh, aluminium, yeah. Mm. So you can see that uh, someone was very creative to go and find out what the first car looked like. Any Kamaile Ford Nico now and Akambia Ford Popular. But this one has been made into a hot rod, like what other people are doing yeah. around the world. So this one, they put a very powerful, massive engine on it. And when you put a powerful engine on such a car and you upgrade the, you upgrade the suspension and everything, that means Igari Imeko a hot rod. You know, like it's hot, man, and it's powerful. This is some cars even are known as a lift up because of the, of the torque and the power. So this is a model that I, I really love. But for me, I'd say this hot rodding is not really for me. I, I, <laughs> me. I love stock. And even if I put an engine, it will not be for racing. Because, I, I mean, I, I believe that if you have such a car, guy, any, you, you want to be seen driving slower. How on a raka? 10 kilometers per hour? Want to be seen? Let people appreciate the, seen, the huh? build. You yes, exactly. <laughs> but if you're speeding off, <laughs> I say, nobody sees you. So yeah. if you wanted to speed off, buy a Subaru. It's nice to just keep yeah. these things stock, then buy a fast car. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So you end up spending two million or three million hot roading this thing while you get a Subaru Moja no Masana STI. Yeah. Uh, in fact, for three million, you can even get a, a Nissan GTR Skyline. Uh, so, guys, do you know any more Skyline by now? <laughs> yeah? I'm not saying at Nivibayak Hot Road, I love Hot Roads, I love the fr my friends, what they've done. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful, amazing. But uh, it's not my cup of tea, and me, I love to, you know, that's why you see most of my cars are stock. Uh, Captain, kuna, kuna moja we, when, I'm, when I'm turning up for a certain event, Nitengia na your Captain Omar. You know, we have to represent how we roll with these machines, flying machines, you know, we love being up there. So uh, sometimes I'll turn up with this. And sometimes when you're doing the shoots for our garage and things like that, we'll put this. Omar 001, this is when I'm turning up Ukoinje. But Nikikua garage, then now this is for the Omar garage, which is our favorite because, I mean, this is... Our garage is what has brought us here. We believe in uh, doing good things and good projects. So yeah? Omar, so after this, you know what yeah. to go see some of your bits, uh, bits uh, my, my bills yes yeah, yes, yes 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 how you are rolling here yes by the way i forgot to mention one of my favorites the bikes, the bikes. back in the day nilikuwa naitwa omar biker boy yeah. everybody knew me as omar biker boy omar biker boy so now if you really want to know where i came from me i'm a biker i love bikes and i love machines and ever since i was a kid nilikuwa naendesha ma bicycle Nika, you know, my mom couldn't afford to buy me a bicycle, so I want a bike, will you go to school or will I buy you a bicycle? It was that simple. So, I said, hey, my mom doesn't buy a bike, I don't want to buy a bike, I don't want to buy a Break money, I save. I used to save it. 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 Now, there was a neighbor of mine who was named Wahome, I think. Alikuwa make a bike ame litoka UK but he never rode it ilikuwa na pancha na nini mm. so, so I bought that bike imagine for 2000 bob na na save 10 bob 10 bob <laughs> I have a golden bike a, a 24 karat gold bike I have the same bike in Dubai it's called a Harley David's Big Dog 24 karat gold plated uh, transparent engine full custom 4 years in the making amazing so I have the same bike I have the same bike. I have the same hammer. You still have them in Dubai? Yes. Or you had them? I have them. And uh, do you plan to bring them in? Okay. Well, uh, that's, uh, that's questionable because unless you uh, a number plate at UG. Uh, oh, because of the age? Uh, yes. You have a number plate at UG. I'm a Ningiza South Sudan, or, you know, but <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, I can bring them and I will bring them. Uh, These rims are original. GT500 Shelby Ford 25 by 45 RCMG. Yes. 
This ones I'm going to put it in one build. That's that's gonna be a muscle car actually. Now yo ni gari speed. Unaona? It's like a Subaru ya zamani. Ford, Ford GTS. So I made a Ford. I have a, a Ford Cortina MK3 which I'm going to make it to be like uh, the real thing but with not the I mean with a very big powerful massive engine. Yeah. So guys I uh, just want to tell you uh, I know you've seen this car before the Gladiator. Yeah. This one we build it from nothing. By the way, remind me to send you the video yeah. before and after so the guys can have an idea. Zamani Igari Likaje, you know, like yeah. because it has the side steps, I put the roll cage, Nikeka the snuckle, uh, the, the custom steering, custom bucket seats, you know. I lifted it up, they make a music, they make a custom tank. All those were not there. Imendi Kwaumar, Hai Kutoka Karibu. I built this car with blood and sweat. Muliona uh, Ilengine, the, the car that I showed you, Fast and Furious. So this one, when I bought this car, I had already seen that look. That big, massive body, you know, the low rider kind of a look. Unajua? This is, a, I, I bought this car in Bomet. That was about three years. When I built this car, this was about three years, and this was my first project when, when I came back to Kenya. How bad was it? It was very, very bad. Was it running or you just... It was running, no brakes. It was not that badly off Kamazile Zingene. Yeah, so this is a car that uh, I say, ni machine we use. A lot of people tell me, are you selling it, are you selling it? But sometimes I want to sell it, but na kikumbuka mali tumetoka nayo. It's brought me a lot of business. I appreciate what it's brought me. And this other car, I bought it from a good friend of mine, and it was VJ in Thika. That's another car enthusiast and a classic guy. Uh, he sold for me this car. I'd seen this car on the internet. I'd seen it with my friend. This is a 1964 Ford Zephyr. Uh, stock, uh, stock, uh, stock, uh, stock, engine is straight six. Yeah, so this one is going to be a massive project. Uh, it's going to have a body kit. It's going to have that front nose, the Minuka. It's going to have the sunroof. It's going to have those bucket seats, you know? Mm. So, I, I mean, I have a, a very... So, it has a running engine? No, okay. I don't even have an engine. I bought this thing as a, as a shell. shell, yes. Oh. In fact, this car was my friend's car. Oh. A little later, I built it for him. Oh. Then, one day after, like one month, I could kind of listen, bro, man, I'm leaving, I'm going to UK, no, US. Please, sina mali ya kuwacha hii gari, buy it off from me. I'm like, and yes, you need gari. Niko, I've got so many projects of my own, I don't really need another project. Because project means four, five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred thousand. Oh, you love to follow this bit. Yeah. Just don't take too long on it. <laughs> it may take ten years. <laughs> Let's go break the bank. One and I can to na one month. This is an amazing, amazing, amazing car. This one is the only Niambia in it was Fiat Baby. It's the baby of the garage. Mtoto wa garage. Yeah. So I've done the the brake system yote. As you can see, ni meka kila kitu ningine. I'm still building it. Ni metenge za gear system, clutch system. I've done the engine. I'm going to make it a an open roof. So, as you can see, this one, I've done it piece by piece. I removed this engine, I worked on the engine, I worked on the cabs, I worked on the radiator, cleaned it, fixed it, so everything. I put, uh, I, I, I made this to more powerful uh, alternator. Uh, that is the water pump, exhaust system, nimeweka nyingine. So this car, it's going to be running like a new car, guys. So, I mean, uh, I love this machine. It's going to be one of my favorite uh, machines in the road. It's going to be for my daughter, Aneto Hayat. So this car, I've built it for my daughter, who is called the Hayat. Now, by the way, um, I have another one also, I, because I have two daughters. Eh? So I have another one, it, uh, 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 I'm building it for Yasmin. So yeah, so to we, we'll make something amazing, we'll do something good, uh, we'll make sure that uh, this thing 
holds and drives like a new car up to wakuje ku grow even though they are only 3 years old and 2 years old so this is how you know it, it was built mostly this car was built for a lady so if you are wearing a skirt unajua utakuja ukunje skirt alafu now you you sit in unaona eh yeah? so that's that's how you you relax on this baby bana so front ndio kuna tank guys tank ya mafuta iko hapa that's where the battery stays upon the brake fluid in Nigeria. So hapa uh, iko na mshipi. I'm sure you are wondering mshipi ni nini. Eh? Uh, Umezoea kuona mshipi kwa jeans but this one actually you can uh, strap it in there bro. So iko na buckle baka. So you put a buckle on it na una strap. So that's going to have the logo. We're going to put the logo hapa alafu iko na emblems zingine hapa. So this one is just the first coat. I haven't done the final coat on it, guys. Uh, it's going to be really very, very beautiful car. We have the Crown, we have the Pijot 504, Hapo. Tuko Isuzu, we've made it into a pickup truck. Yeah. We have another one. For, for a reason, people love to bring me Suzuki's. So this is a Maruti, guys. Pijot 203. One of my favorite builds in uh, in my garage. So this car, I love it. Uh, this is where the indicator comes from. So if you're indicating Ukombele, this is where the indicators are talking. So you can imagine in a, in a, in a bit, ti, 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 ti. then it starts blinking. Ti, 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 ti. Then when you finish indicating, in a rudiaba, ti, 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 in a jifunga. So it's something really amazing, guys. Mlangu wanyumo na funguka normally, but now let me tell you, eh? Back in the day, Queen Elizabeth alikuwa kuinge kwa gari yake, hakutaka kuka, like, you know, so a gentle, a, a woman would come and atapweka skati yake, haka liendani ya gari. These are not the real seats, hini ya gari ingine. The seats, I'm redoing them to brand new seats and everything. So, this car, I've done the engine, I've done the bodywork, uh, on the, the first, the, let's say the first hand, yeah, the bodywork. I've bought some new tires, as you can see. These are brand new Comforcer tires, yeah. Uh, 205, 70 by 15, eh? Comforcer tires, the brand new, Jai Kanyaga Barabara, brand new tires, as you can see, guys. And so that, that's how it's gonna look with the wheel cup. On this build, I said I am not gonna put broad rims. Igari, it will be having its original rim and original wheel cup. So this one is going to have its original wheel cup, guys. As you can see, the Pijots, Ikonaile Simba. Simba, this is a 1955 Chases number one. The first build, yeah, Pijot. So as you can see, Apo Tukonayo, wherever this is where the plugs go, do your engine. Do your radiator. Mm. So that is the air cleaner, and that's the engine. So I've built it from nothing, bro. Nothing, nothing. Totally like it was. It was a piece of junk. But now you can see the engine looks good. The car starts. So it's just the bodywork that I'm, I need to deal with. Nimalzane na yue gari garinzuri. I'm very very passionate about uh, this build. Siani ni the black number plate KMZ six. So this, this car is very special, this is number one. It belongs to Sago Radiators. Sago Radiators, alikuwa menunuwa kwa mtu mwingine. Another Mwindi guy, uh, Kalasinga guy, put it on his yard for 45 years. Then before that, ilikuwa, ikona full history. This, it belonged to the, the empire, like yeah, Queen Elizabeth. So I bought this car uh, na fleet zingine. So this is what I call Chevrolet Style Master Big Mama. So. Big Mama, the reason I call it Big Mama because it's big and huge and it's hippie. No, I call it hips. So uh, I call it the Big Mama. So my cars are named. My cars have names. Nikona Gladiator, Nikona Fast and Furious, Nikona Munyama, Nikona Simba Pale. Yeah? So my cars have names. So guys, musi, musi tuchekele sana, but we love to name our cars. So any Big Mama. So the doors are there, the doors are there, the back door, the front door. I've already done all the welding. This car came, kabisa. The first thing I did was to wakisha it. I, 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 I made the car to at least to go on, at least ikawaka. After kuwaka, now I started building it. Nikijua confidently the engine is working. This is what you call a Ford Popular. 
and uh, this car I've already bought a new engine for it the reason for that well I would have kept the original engine but uh, as I told you I don't like changing the engine but I'll build this engine and if I work so if anyone wanted to buy the car would find it with the original engine but I'll change the engine near Kea Garingine a more powerful engine which I already bought in Ikoapo Kwa store I'm going to install a Datsun 1200 engine because it can carry the weight. The Datsun were very, very strong cars. The reason I'm using that engine is very easy to install. It works well with a lot of builds. Any engineer, every person who has a quick engine kwa gari, the easiest one. This is my own personal project. That is my car. So I me but a chance that there's so many cars nearly released from uh, December and I didn't have time. I was doing this car since December. So nearly ends up taking a Gary, I think some late November, November somewhere up on any any time nearly kwana but a chance I, I build mine while I build the other customers' cars. But now that the customers' cars in Meenda, those new new cars no just nenda raka. So now I have a chance to work on my own car. We're finishing it today. Today I can't wait to go back on the road with it. Ninge kwa barabara, niende ni furaie. And I enjoy to actually just have my car back in the road, you know. Uh, you had seen it last in the show and I may change. So we have a lot of things that we're coming up with. Brand new uh, rims. Uh, from, I mean, they were there from last time, but it has a new rim, actually. New tires are coming. The tires are still good, but I still want, you know, nothing feels like... Ukiona hiyo uzi uzi ya tire, unasikia raha, unajua, like, brand new tires. So, uh, brand new tires are coming, guys, and um, I must tell you, as Omar's garage, siyezi kwa natembea na gari ambaye ni meshindo kutengeneza na to maintain, and you want to maintain an image, but the same maturity begins at home. So, guys, if you see me building this car, it's not because I want to boast ni seme ni me build the gari, no, but, that, but I, I just want to build this car so I can have a sample. So if a customer comes into my garage and an Uliza, hey, ukona gari gani umetengeneza? I don't hey, ni meanza ku scroll. Hey, ndio hii picha, ndio hii picha. Hey, ndio hii picha, you know? It's very hard for a customer to believe kwa picha. But when you have your actual car, yenye unaonyesha mtu ndio hii gari hapa, ama anakuja na ipata imepaka hapo, built, not bought by Omar's garage. Inajiongelea yenyewe. So guys, uh, if you need to build your car na ukona hizi gari za zamani zimekushinda just know there's one stop location in Riru, uh, exit 11, next to Zitek University to, to Kondania Bazaar Motors. My telephone number is 0700088088, as I'm sure it a kwa blog. So at Omar's Garage, we have, we have a lot of cars in Gari Pluto. In Gari Pluto, to Lito Ayo Fender. Ika to Leo Bampa Yambele, Bampa Yanyuma, Nini. So we have, we have. We have so many cars that we and people are appreciating and people are enjoying their cars out there. And whenever I, 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 I pass through and I see one of the cars in Nimetengeneza, it just gives me a very nice happiness that at least that was my build, you know. So someone can go out there and say, hey, Nimetengeneza to Omar's garage. And to me, that's my happiness. So as in Guinea, it's not all about money. It's not about money, it's about passion. So I do this job. Not because at it pays a lot of money, no, but it, it's, it gives you a lot of self-happiness and rewards here for Raha ya Roho. So make sure guys you subscribe to Amoke Vlogs. Na tuwaone hapa kwa Omar Garage mkuja kutembelea. It's very nice to have you my brother. Thank you so much. And uh, tunawapenda nyote. So guys, uh, it was a uh, wonderful spending time with you, Omar. Absolutely, all my pleasure, bro, We have man. spent like half a day here. That Kabisa means man. that uh, your bills are so many. Yeah, you, bro. You call it Nash built, built, not, not bought. bought. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, this was Showcase with Amoke Vlogs. If you want uh, similar stuff like this, hit me on my DM, Amoke Vlogs on IG. Yeah. So Omar. Yeah. Feel free guys, uh, na shukuru sana bro kwa kutembea na nataka uambia watu. Get, make sure guys, please don't let me down. 
please subscribe ask him questions muulize Omar garage ko wapi is a wonderful guy easy guy to be around unaona nime spend na the whole day the, the half of the day and still bado nasikia tunaweza endelea to story baka jioni so he's a good guy and uh, i want you to support him so that channel is kuendelea so he can bring for you the the things which hamu party kwingine na hamuoni kwa kwa places zingine so this guy gives you the real real built not bought projects zenye watu wamelalisha pale nyumbani kwa garages and all the other places looking forward to see you online tukiongea kwa mtandao we love you guys tunasema tunawapenda nyote guys see you, on the, next video. See you on the next one kudos